Good evening. After finishing the annual revamp of the forum, already fourth in a row, quite some things happened along with that. The discussion on our forum was more intensive, so were the updates on our site. Also some changes were made in our staff. It all still makes me exciting, but here's something else. Only one edition of Night New and News divides us from our 50th one. As you already know we'll try to prepare something special for this occasion, but let's do first things first. Here is what we prepared for today. Pokemon Hargold and Soul Silver Thriller. Forum Revamp. Sport Discussion. Topic of the Week. Side Updates. Some Bionicle Updates. Twitter Updates. Let's begin. This week we broadcasted Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver game trailer. It presents some moments from the upcoming games which will be out in spring next year. You're warmly welcome to watch it. 17th and 18th August we performed our annual revamp of the forum. Some new features are in store for you. There was some changes in layout and functionality and also some staff changes. Some staff members were demoted mostly due to inactivity or by their own choice and some were promoted. What has changed and what changes the staff encountered you can read on our forum. Congrats to the team who worked on changes and congrats to all promoted. 19th August was the beginning of the game's convention replacement, Gamescom. Our staff covered the event with news posted on our forum. Take a look and discuss away. I've updated our Bionicle Books guide for you this week so you would be able to be updated with the newest things released. Bionicle graphic novels are still waiting to be listed there but don't worry. They will be listed in a few days. Also in Bionicle section we bring the news that already the fourth Bionicle movie will be out these days. 24th August exactly will be the happy day in UK and 15th September in USA. Read all details in Bionicle section. Since we've just finished forum revamp sport was put into separate section of general discussion it became even more alive than ever. Mostly we discuss rugby of course as almost entire staff are fans of this sport, but the discussion goes on also on other fields like football, the athletic world championship, cricket and other interesting themes like who of the famous sportsmen or sportswomen do you know in person or you've just met or about if you are active in the sport you like. Welcome to come and discuss with us. This week quite some titles were brought to see where and they're all great and some long anticipated. Read the topic and see which games they attracted our staff the most. You've already noticed the main theme and sports section of general discussion is rugby and our staff came to an idea of trying to make our own rugby squad. Are you player as well and interested in gaming and Doctor Who enough to join to our forum and fill up one of the empty space in our rugby squad? You're welcome to join us and participate in our fun. Ashes cricket is one of the main sports themes this week as well. England is doing good so far and hopefully it will continue this way. If you follow the happenings on the tourney you're welcome to join us in the discussion of course. As we posted the updates from Gamescom all week, now we would like to hear a bit about what do you think about this event from you. This week's topic of the week is the discussion about this. Whatever opinion do you have you're welcome to tell us about it. What do we think? Come to our forum and take a look. This week our member D.R. celebrated his 13th birthday. Congrats from Nine Nui and the news redaction as well. Hopefully you'll soon come back and join us in fun we have. 
Speaking about rugby discussion, the main theme these days is the first match of Cardiff Blues played on their new stadium. They lost the game, but those who watched the match said they all, players and crowd had good time though. If you were amongst those fortunate to be there, you're welcome to say your opinion. In blackout rugby, Ta only reports that his team is the first in his league. Congrats to the team. As he hopes, we hope too, that he holds this position until the end of the season and even when the new one begins. Congrats. As we can see this fall will be rich with new games titles and we surely won't need to wait all the way until Christmas to grab some long announced and expected titles to play. From this week until New Year's Day we will offer you previews of titles which are about to be released. First part of fall previews is here with Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2 for all platforms. There are also bonus previews for you to read. You're welcome to visit our site and read them all. Not only previews, review is also here for you to read. This time this is Elite Beat Agents. But, watch out, those are not agents we imagine. Read on the review and you'll see what this game is really about. We've reached our 450s update on Twitter this week. Mostly we kept you up to date with our forum revamp and then we just had to tell you a part of our staff will be on Cardiff City Stadium watching the first match of Cardiff Blues rugby team there. Was it fun? Ask our staff or go to our forum to read some brief things. As I write this in the news scenario, we have 452 updates, 30 followers and we're following 10 tweeters. This was everything for tonight. We'll be back for our 49th edition next Saturday. Have a great week and don't forget to visit our forum to play games and do some other fun stuff. On our site there are previews and reviews for you to read so don't miss any of them. Good night from Nighghost and Night Newer Staff. <laughs>